My name is Simone Mink, Digital Execution Practice Lead at Mendix, and with me today I have Kasia Maximiak. Kasia, can you introduce yourself? What does the world need to know about Kasia? Well, I'm a recent Mendix MVP, and I recently also launched the Mendix Loco Ladies. Community for women, right? Community exactly. for women, exactly. Yeah, that's ex exciting. And we're going to talk more about that in a future episode for sure. But talking about community, how has the Mendix community in general played a role for you in your development as a professional? The Mendix community just shaped me as a whole in terms of content, all these information in one virtual space, uh, the blogs, Ryan Maki with videos, uh, Mendix Forum, Mendix Slack, Mendix Meetups. It's not only one big party to see everyone, but I'm learning every day from them. That's so great to hear. And uh, well, you are a very active part of the Mendix community. Actually, uh, one of the reasons amongst many that you were named a Mendix MVP is because you have been an outstanding advocate for Mendix. So in digital execution practice, we say that promoting low code visions and successes is crucial to an organization's low code adoption and long-term success. How would you recommend people to start talking about low code? For me, it's all about the practical examples of low code because low code is an abstract word. But if you explain how it works that you can upload an Excel sheet into Mendix Studio Pro and you get half an app that, that's almost working and you have to just tweak it. That's the power of low code, showing a process, uh, how the application logic works um, in just blocks that are understandable for the business. That's the most powerful thing about low code that people understand. They don't understand lines of codes. If you show them visually how the application reacts and thinks, then they can translate it to their own knowledge and their expertise. All right. And, and sticking on the, on the topic of promotion, why do you think promoting your team's success uh, with low code and the apps you're building with low code is important? Well, change is hard. And when you come up with a new app, um, the answer is often, yeah, but the old app works and how much is it going to take, how long and stuff and, and questions like that. And if you can show the people around that you can build an app in such a short period of time uh, with high quality and take them along the journey uh, while you're building the app, it just proves the whole organization that it's worth to invest in low code and that you can see results right away. Beautiful answer. Thank you very much and thank you for joining me. And thank you for watching. Tune in next time for more information.